Well, this guy's leaving today. Any minute now, I put him out for a little bit just so that he could stretch his legs. He was in all night. Gosh, I'm gonna miss him. He's such a good boy. This one's doing really well. I think we may have avoided disaster here with her injury. I wormed everybody this morning, so they were a little grumpy at me. But they seem to have forgiven me. My cutie pie. It smells like spring out here. Oh, nope, there we go. And here we go again. Well, we are down to two horses, which is really weird. This is the first time on this farm we've had less than three, so two horses left. We have two more horses coming soon. We have, my friend is sending her yearling over for me to play with for a little while. And then Anthem is coming back and both of those horses will be for sale. But yeah, they're coming probably after I get back from Disneyland, both of those horses will come. And then at some point here, I gotta find myself a dressage horse. So we should be back up in numbers pretty quickly. I'm gonna miss Owen, he was a special horse. He really was like that horse. They don't come any sweeter, they really don't. He's, oh, she's talking. I think Stroker just realized Owen was gone. He just called for him. Um, they don't come any sweeter than Owen. He was just special. He's like Gracie, but like a giant one. And probably a little more just like heart. I don't know, he's a special guy. I'm gonna miss him a lot. I'm really glad I got the chance to play with him. Thank you very much, Mokeets Village, for leasing me your sweet horse. He's a special, special boy. So I am headed to my trainers. I'm gonna go over there and be an extra set of hands for them today. And I'm not sure how much of that I'm gonna be able to film or should film. So this may be all you kind of see of that. But we'll see, we'll see. May, may get a few little puppy clips here and there. Feels so different. Amanda is gonna be really happy, and I'm happy too. You want my hair? I'm a good looking dude. I am a good looking dude. All right, I'm going back to work. Hello, everybody. Hi, Dr. Nick. My name's Amanda. Oh, okay. I spent all day washing horses, and then I got to ride a horse. It was fun. Did, I enjoyed these. Did things. you record it? No. You need to record these things, Amanda. But they're not my horses. No. I explained this to them already. The barber was not my hair barber. Barbara? Barbara. Barbara. I hair think her Barbara. name is something else. Hair Barbara. He looks so handsome. So handsome. We're going to go get some dinner. And then i got to clean the house because his friend is coming to stay with us. For one night. This hurts my pinky. Italian food with this handsome fella. Matthew is the meanest. But I do like his haircut. It looks good. That's a good haircut. Hey, ladies. Hey. Amanda's outside getting those ponies to go to bed. I'm sitting in the truck because of reasons. It's pretty simple. I'm just waiting on Amanda. There's Stroker. It's hard to see him because it's so dark. I love these big stalls. I wish they were all the same. Eating this hay. Tuesday's nut. Tuesday's not sure what to do with all the extra space in this giant stall. She got the upgrade. Look at all that space she has. These are our, like folding stalls. But the kids get to use them tonight. 
That is a nice haircut and a nice little beard trim there. Not quite as crazy faced anymore, just in time for my conference. And it makes Amanda happy. So, you know what? I resolve to get my haircut and my beard trimmed like this a lot more often. I keep forgetting as a husband sometimes that, you know, I, I have to keep trying. Uh, just because I'm married doesn't mean I should stop trying to impress my wife. I gotta make sure I look good and all that jazz. Yeah, because I don't want her to be married to a stinkly, hairy dude. So, yeah. Don't forget to try. You gotta keep trying. <sighs> well, I did it again. I stayed up late. It is 1.45, so not all nighter like I usually do, but getting in bed after midnight. And it's just I got so much darn work to do, and I just get rolling on one thing, and I move into the next thing, and move into the next thing. And uh, it's just... It's just crazy, I get carried away. You know, that's that's okay, because I love what I do. It gets a little frustrating sometimes, but uh, everything does, especially if you're passionate about something. If you're a passionate painter, sometimes you get frustrated if you can't get this one thing looking the way you want it. Um, but yeah, so my passion is the work that I do. I love what I do. If I ever, when I ever retire from this, uh, I think my second passion would be cooking. I really want to go and become a cook. Um, like go to culinary school and learn the art and science behind cooking uh, and not just the I'm gonna throw some crap in a pan that I do now but uh yeah so not quite 2 a.m. yet so I'm gonna go sneak in bed because I got another long day of work tomorrow and then another long day of work after that but then this weekend is the conference I'm going to a conference in far away Orlando and uh yeah i'm excited it's gonna be a good one so good night everybody don't forget you can subscribe don't forget to like this video i mean look at my beard i got it cut and it's still an awesome beard like yeah i'm sleepy i'm going to bed now